What's going on, YouTube? This is Mag Dog TV. We coming back with another one. Utah football team just got dominated by the Colorado Buffaloes. Their quarterback, Isaac Wilson, tight end, as well as head coach, Kyle Whittingham, just spoke out about the Colorado Buffs. I have the video clips in this video, so we're going to talk about that. So let's get to it. <laughs> If no one understands how good of a football team the Colorado Buffaloes is, then they clearly probably haven't been watching Colorado football. Let's just keep it a buck. Colorado Buffaloes control their own destiny in regards to the Big 12 Conference play. They have an opportunity to not only win the conference championship, but get to the college football playoffs. I have the video clip of Utah head coach speaking out about the Colorado Buffaloes along with their starting quarterback, Isaac Wilson, brother of Zach Wilson. I'm going to play these video clips and let you guys hear it. Uh, we just came out flat to start the game. You know, I I made some mistakes. Everyone made mistakes, and we got to clean that up. We got to come out fast and start start strong. We can't keep playing catch-up every game. You know, it starts in the run game. We got to make better blocks for our running backs, and we got to give Isaac more time to build the ball, and we just, we just got to, you know, Got to stop making the same mistakes. Uh, they made more plays than we did. That's the end of the story. You can only control what you can control, so uh, we can't really worry about what's going on the other side of the ball. We just we got to feed off each other. We got to have each other's back. So we just we handle our job, and that's it. Get that thing put together. Uh, I don't think there's any doubt it's the best team we've played this year. Uh, certainly the best group of receivers, best quarterback. Uh, quarterback's terrific. Um, receivers as a group, or you know, they got superstar in there, obviously, but as a group, they're really good. And so, uh, credit them for the win. Uh, as bad as things were, we still had a chance there in the fourth quarter. We got that turnover and had momentum and in their territory, and and I proceeded to turn the ball over again. We had four turnovers. Tough to win. Turn the ball over four times if you want. If you want to know. What our main deficiencies were, it was that and the inability to run the football. We didn't run the ball uh, anywhere near where we needed to. Um, disappointing. Um, defense, we did some good things, got three takeaways. Still lost the turnover margin, minus one, but, but uh, we didn't tackle particularly well. Enough. And those, those athletes they got over there are a big reason for that. I don't want to discount their, their uh, ability and their, their skill because they're it's a great group. They've put together an outstanding group. So, This was well said by Utah head coach Kyle Whittingham along with Isaac Wilson in regards to the Colorado Buffaloes. Colorado football is a very good football team. Let's just keep it a buck. This football team can go very far, especially when they play a full 60 minutes. We also had LeBron James speaking out about the Colorado Buffs. He also spoke out about the Colorado haters along with the Deion Sanders haters, as you guys can see on the screen right there. But Colorado Buffaloes must continually play full 60 minutes every week in, week out. And they have that opportunity, as I said before, to really get far and far for this upcoming season. This is no surprise for those that have been covering Colorado or those have been watching Colorado. You guys been glued to my channel from the very beginning since last year to now. We have seen a big shift in regards to how people treat this Colorado Buffaloes football team, but it goes to show you what happens when you stay focused, you keep grinding, and you just put the work in front of you and let God do the rest. And not only just for this football team, but in life in general, we can see it clearly. And we saw what Coach Prime did when all the naysayers was coming at him every single week. Drop in the comments and let me know how you guys feel. If you guys like the video, definitely subscribe to the channel. Peace.